Hey there, everyone. Welcome back to Ladder Up, where today we are 4 and 2. I think it's, um... Oh, we get Mike from New York with a rating of 1629. I believe it's Thursday. Okay, so already a little bit of, a little bit of some issues here. They've got Nihilego, Nihilego, however you want to say it, Giardos, and Giardos, not Giardos, Giardos, uh, the Zerka Tree, the Lolan Marowak, which is a problem because of the Lightning Rod, Tapu Bulu, which I think is not very good, and uh, Celesteela, which everyone should know by now is annoying. It's super annoying. So how do we deal with this? I think here our best bet uh, is Pheromosa and Tapu Lele. It's either Pheromosa Tapu Lele or Arcanine Tapu Lele, I think. I think. The question is, does he lead Tapu Bulu? If he leads Tapu Bulu, then it's a bit more difficult. The Gyarados lead is a problem. I think this is the best one. I don't think Drop is that good. Drompa is immune to one of... It's immune to, to ghost types, and it resists fire type. So it's decent against Marowak, especially if, if you intimidate Marowak. Drompa can... It can live Flare Blitzes, um, and you can you can Oko with Dragon Pulse. So I just... Okay, definitely Arcanine. And then Magneton is... Yeah, I think Magneton... I think I need Magneton for the Gyarados and for the... Uh, Celesteela. Yes. So, Magnet Pull, Magneton. You know, it's okay. We gotta get rid of the Marowak first. Because Marowak could protect the Arcanine. Or, sorry, the Marowak could protect the Gyarados and the Celesteela. And that's not good for us at all. Okay, this is okay. This, this is fine. This is totally fine. What else do we have on the team? You know what? And I just remembered, I don't even have to remember what else is on the team because we can just check Mike's team. Okay, so he has nothing immune to Psychic type. So here, I'm pretty free here to high jump kick the Nihilego, which is fine. And Psychic the Zerka Tree. He switches in. I kind of want to just Z move right off, right off the bat. Yeah, because I, I know I know Life Orb picks it up. Life Orb picks it up easy. Um, but I, I now have the Z Crystal, so I don't know if it picks it up. And I'm worried about him switching in, like, Tapu Bulu. Okay, that's fine. That's not fine. That's not fine. We take, we take damage when we don't want to. So that's half our health right there. We do have an odd number of health, so we can actually... We can miss two. It's Choice Scarf. It's Choice Scarf. If Pheromosa gets paralyzed here, or just knocked out... Cho Cho Choice Scarf, really? Choice Scarf? Really? That is the first time I've seen a Choice Scarf Zerka tree. I guess I probably should have protected... I was I was worried about the, the not... I, I couldn't let... I couldn't let his, his, his Nihilego, uh, like, Sludge Bomb my Tapu Lele just for free. That's why I went for the high jump kick but still the choice scarf is annoying so we trade knockouts but Ferramosa is a huge source of damage for me so now what does he send in rock poison rock poison he's got Celesteela and he's got Gyarados and he's got Marowak he sends in Marowak I'm not worried about it Magneton's good here Top of Bulu. Okay. So the... Oh, man. The, uh... Yeah. Ferramosa destroys Top of Bulu with Poison Jab. How much do I think this will do? It's super effective against both. The Neo Lego just protected. So does it switch out or attack? I don't know. Top of Bulu, I'm going to protect. I'm definitely protecting. Definitely protecting. Oh, sorry. Top of Lele, I'm protecting. Just because I want the grassy terrain health. And he does go for the, slu he does go for the sludge bomb into it, which I, that's what I was worried about. 
He goes for a superpower in the Magneton, but I should be able to take this. I don't... What is happening? I thought I'd be able to take that. Apparently, I don't. Apparently, I suck at this game. Oh, well. That Choice Scarf Zerka Tree just really ruined everything. Oh, my God. This thing is strong. How do I win this? I have to get a double protect, basically. Right? I would have to. I would have to get a double protect. Because I can't outspeed I cannot speed the jellyfish. I cannot speed it. Um And my only chance is to get a little more health back from grassy terrain and and put it at minus one with snarl. That's my only chance. This is still winnable, technically. Not really, but technically. If he's got, oh, we don't get it. We don't get it. So that, that yeah, top of the is gone. Oh, man. Special attack, okay, yeah. I mean, I, I, I know, I know, you know, the jellyfish is pretty fast. But yeah, I needed I needed the double protect because if I got the double protect, I could have won this game still. And superpower again. Is that choice banded? Is that why? Is that why? That's gotta be choice banded. That's why I took out Magneton. Because I know it gets superpower, but I wasn't worried about it. Because I have Eviolite. I'm like I could take that, but apparently I don't because of the superpower. But I can't take out the jellyfish. I certainly can't take out the jellyfish. But, okay, so, for the sake of Burn Up is, what, what type is, is Burn Up? Burn Up is a special attack. For the record, let's see how much a Burn Up does this top of Bulu. We've already lost, so. The Burn Up will actually remove our fire typing, which will make us not weak to the rock type move. Marowak. Okay, well, that's Power Gem. But it outspeeds, of course. So, if we had... If that hadn't been Choice Scarf Zerka Tree, which there's no way to tell that. There's just no way to tell that. So that's some fun best of one stuff. Um, we, yeah, if we had still... Losing Faramosa was basically the end of that. I mean, that, that's the tough thing about Faramosa. It's just... You, it, it's so frail that anything knocks it out. I guess I could have... Well, I, I could have protected first turn. But... Again, I was worried about the Sludge Bomb into Tapu Lele. Because I know Tapu Lele can take out the Zerka Tree. No problem. Okay, so that's not, not good. But we're going to keep going. And remember, this is all early. So, you know, 4 and 3, not great. But we're learning. We know now that Choice Scarf Zerka Tree is apparently a thing. We know that, that the Jellyfish is strong. So we've got Tapu Lele and Milotic, which is another Pokemon someone suggested using Milotic. Arcanine, Garchomp, Marowak, and Porygon Z. So, I think here... Pheromos and Porygon might actually not be a bad... Might not be a bad lead. I kind of want to do that, actually. I'll bring Tapu Lele, and then who else do I want? Uh, Arcanine is probably the best... Drompa is not bad. It's really not bad. I think Arcanine for Intimidate, though, is probably better. It's probably the better one. Basically, Pheromos is so fast that I can... The only thing I would, I would, I would bring Drompa for over anything else is... Uh, if, the, if, the por if I thought he was going to try and get Trick Room up with Porygon Z, then I would want to bring Drompa. But honestly, his team, it doesn't look like Trick Room. It looks like maybe Thunder Wave. So... Basically, we're just going super fast here. Lots of offense. Milo to Garchomp. That's fine. That's okay. What does the Garchomp do? What does the Garchomp do? I'm honestly not that worried about the Garchomp. 
I, do I think a, a Thunderbolt Lunge will take it out? I don't. Do I think a Hyper Beam Lunge will? Actually, you know what I think I'm going to do? I think I'm going to Lunge here. I'm going to Hyper Beam it into the, uh, into the Garchomp. Yeah, that's the bigger threat. The Garchomp's the bigger threat. Okay, that's fine. I guess I could have Hyper Beamed into the, uh, the Milotic like I thought. I, I thought, I didn't think the Garchomp would protect because, well, I mean, what, I go for an Ice Beam? Oh, crap, I forgot, I forgot about Lunge's, uh, secondary ability. Please don't burn me. Please don't burn me. Ah! It's so dumb. So dumb. So dumb. So that's a problem. Ugh, Faramosa, why are you so frail? I forgot Lunge does that. If I just high jump kicked it, it wouldn't have been a big of an issue. It might not even have brought us down to Focus Sash, honestly. Does the Garchomp switch out into something else? I think so. Although, if he, no, if he doesn't, then I just need to take it out right now. Does he leave it in? Probably not. He probably switches it out. Okay, I should have, it's probably Marowak. Okay, I should have switched into Arcanine like I thought. But I actually think this will allow me to... This will be fine. I take out the Milotic, which I don't. Oh my god, he's got everything! Miracoat, really? I didn't think I needed to Z-move there, but apparently I did. Oh my god. Okay, alright. Fun times had by all. Uh, <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> we're getting rocked. So we so we just lost both of those, right? Yeah, we did. Did we? Did we? Did we lose the last game or did we win? I think yeah, we lost the last game for the same reason. Um, the thing is though. I'm gonna have to burn up here. And because he switched into Marowak. Oh, wait. Oh, I thought I could switch because I didn't. I thought because I used Hyper Beam, I didn't have to still use it because it doesn't affect it. But I, I guess because I actually used the move, I'd have to use it again. I didn't think that's how it worked. I thought because I didn't use the move, I would be able to just, you know, switch to Shadow Ball. But I was wrong. Nasty disadvantage using Choice Scarf, everyone. So what did we learn today? We learned that... Faramosa, you gotta protect it. Also, we learned that Faramosa, apparently... It's... I, I always forget that its lunge has a chance to... Oh, wow, we survived that. That's crazy. I forgot that the, uh... Faramosa's lunge has, like, a 50% chance to lower the opposing Pokémon's attack. I forgot about that. Forgot about that. I'm gonna burn up into the Garchomp. Why not? It's not gonna do that much damage, but Marowak probably protects or he withdraws. Either one. Into Porygon too. That's okay. That's fine. It's whatever. Download special attack. Yep. Okay. Earthquake. So he was more worried about... Okay. Okay. So if we got a crit here, it's possible. But we don't. Actually, no. That wouldn't, even, that wouldn't have even knocked it out. 
Oh well. See, so yeah, we've lost this one. But that's okay. That's fine. I'll snarl just because whatever. He maybe switches into Marowak. No, he just earthquakes. The guy doesn't care. Guy don't care. Guy don't care. That does next to nothing to the Porygon. Because it's Ivy Light. Man. So that game. Yeah, losing Ferramosa right away was a problem. If I had high jump kicked, if I just if I had doubled into if I had gone with my gut instinct, which is that Garchomp was going to protect, and gone doubled into the the uh, Milotic, we, 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 we it's a whole different game, it's a whole different game. But unfortunately, that's not the way the cookie crumbles sometimes. So yeah, no, I want to say yes. Well, that's unfortunate, everyone. Man, we we are off to a bit of a rocky start this week. Slash, it's almost the end of the week, and we're. Four and four? Four and four? I think we're four and four. It's not great. We're gonna do better. It's gonna happen. Also, my team's kinda bad. <laughs> my team is kinda bad. But it doesn't matter. It's not the end of the world. Why did I save that? I don't wanna save that. Um Things to remember, Pharamos is frail. Um not having the Clefairy for redirection is bothersome. Because that was very helpful before. And yeah, uh, just lots of stuff. Not Z moving with Tapu Lele on the Milotic might 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 have might have turned things around a little bit. Um, not losing, not lunging into the Milotic would have been better. But anyways, that's gonna be it today, guys, for Ladder Up. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, feel free to like, comment. Share, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And, you know, don't forget, next week I'm bringing new Pokemon. So if you comment something that I like, I'll, I'll use it. Um, I'm trying to make this about you guys. So I uh, hope to see you next time for another episode of Ladder Up.